channel. In this video, we will be discussing about the difference between absolute pressure and gauge pressure. So as the name suggests, absolute pressure is the pressure measured with respect to the absolute zero pressure or the vacuum pressure. On the other hand, gauge pressure is the pressure measured with respect to the local atmospheric pressure. So we can say the gauge pressure is the pressure in excess of the local atmospheric pressure. So we can measure the gauge pressure as the difference between absolute pressure and local atmospheric pressure. So when this difference will be positive, then we can say we have a positive gauge pressure and there may be cases where this difference may be negative and then we can say that we have negative gauge pressure or the gauge pressure is below the local atmospheric pressure. For example, we can see here at location A, we have this, uh, this datum is the complete absolute zero or complete vacuum and the pressure at point A with respect to this uh, vacuum line or this, uh, this, this standard is the absolute pressure at A. Now the gauge pressure at A will be with respect to the local atmospheric pressure. We have the gauge pressure at A in this form. That is the difference between absolute pressure and the local atmospheric pressure. This gives us the gauge pressure at A. On the other hand, at point B, the pressure, the pressure at point B is below atmospheric pressure. So the difference between absolute pressure and the, the local atmospheric pressure will be a negative value and hence we have a vacuum pressure or negative gauge pressure which is also known as the suction pressure. So we will discuss in detail about the suction pressure, where it is found and what are its application in the next video. So I hope from this video it is clear what is the difference between absolute pressure and the gauge pressure. Thank you for watching our video. Please subscribe to the channel, like and share the videos.